In this video, we'll find the percent composition by mass of the water here in this Na2SO4.10H2O. This is sodium sulfate decahydrate. So what we'll do, we'll find the molar mass of the entire compound. First, we find the sodium sulfate, that's right here. Then we find the 10 water molecules, that's right here. When we do that, we end up with a molar mass for the entire compound of 322.24 grams per mole. So let's use the equation here to figure out the percent composition of water. We take the molar mass of water, that's 18.02 grams per mole, and we multiply that by the number of water molecules. There are 10 separate water molecules around the sodium sulfate. Multiply this by 10, and then we divide by the molar mass of the entire compound. We just figured that out. We multiply all of this by 100, that'll give us a percent, and we end up with 55.92%. And what that means is if we have a sample of the sodium sulfate decahydrate, 55.92% of that will be due to the water. So a little more than half of the mass of this whole compound here is due to the water molecules. My periodic table, it rounds to two decimal places. So if you use a different periodic table, you might have a slightly different answer out here. This is Dr. B with the percent composition by mass for Na2SO4.10H2O, sodium sulfate decahydrate. Thanks for watching.